Hello everyone, Jason Wolf here, and welcome back to my C Let's Play. Currently, that current last episode, uh, we suffered a defeat with these guys, the Romans. They're starting to move into our territories. We're starting to recruit more units. I'm also moving my second force over to support it. I'm going to have to start building up my. I'm going to have to build up. Actually, I'm going to raise us. Can I raise a second force? Like other chiefs, elder chiefs will raise. Can reinstate legacy. We'll reinstate a legacy. We'll have heroic nobles again. And actually, we'll go for heroic riders. Voila. And put them in here. We can actually recruit quite a few units. Well, we don't have a lot of money to recruit a lot of units, so we may just leave that guy there. Well, what we're going to do is we're going to send this guy. Once we fill this force up, we're going to send this guy out to help these guys. Uh, right now, the Romans are. Beat us back. The last episode, uh, I was attacked by this force and they defeated us. It was a close defeat. And we also see that there's a Roman force sieging one of my allies. There's also they also liberated the Iverni. So I'm not sure. I think the Iverni are now. That must mean the Iverni is. No, they have a military alliance with the Pictonians said Rome liberated them so I'm not sure what happened there and there's this lone Roman soldier Here we're also trying to use our agents more aggressively than before before I was using them more of a uh, passive abilities like spraying my own culture cult uh, Celtic culture uh, training my troops and just scouting but now I'm being using them to well Disrupt the enemies, forces, poison, assassinate, all that stuff. All that good stuff, so. We'll just end the turn here, see what Rome decides to do. My spy. I should really have moved my spy further. Now that. Ooh, okay, ooh, what's going to happen? They're going to siege. Okay, so they're going to siege our settlement. And they have sieged it. Okay, so we're gonna have to deal with that. Port of the step. I'm not sure what they're doing. Oh, I think the I think the Gaelic Confederation is actually trying to help us. All right, agent has been exposed. Settlement under siege. What was that? Attrition report? How are you suffering? Okay, our troops here are suffering from attrition. Okay. Our town will surrender in three turns if, if we can't get any help. So. To do. What, do what can we do? Salt patrol. Assassinate. We can't really assassinate. It's not really good. Not really in our favor. So we'll do. We'll do show of force. See what happens here. And subversion has been successful. And our war main has ranked up. So that's going to help. We're going to get our spy to military subtrage and intercept orders. Uh, well, poison provisions. And that has failed. Now, Gaelic Confederation, they're hanging around with Rome, so are they, like, We have need of talk, I'm sure. We also need good food, a warm fire, and warm women. We need the good <laughs> what? You against these Seriously? Foes. He wants to join the war against the 
those guys. Well, I am technically at, but I am at war with them, so. Uh, let's see if they'll join us. can be tasteless, but when we have agreement, it makes wine sweeter and gives meat savor. Okay, let's try this again. Offer everything we own. Seriously, we join you in a war and you're not even going to help us. Okay. Welcome, worthy friend. If we're a worthy friend, you'd, let us, you'd trade with us. Regamon, buddies. Greetings. Civilized folk. Oh, f well, we don't have, want anything to do with you then. Greetings. We are civilized folk. Ah. Non-aggression, so we got a non-aggression. Will we get a trade? We'll ah, we got a trade! You and we just discovered a couple new factions! Okay, good. So, Bithuani... Oh, you guys are still around. Greetings. Now, speak plainly. All praise to the gods. We're getting more yes. trade. That's always the good. Show wisdom beyond your year. Oh, I'm smart. Or I'm wise. I am honored to receive you. Now we're getting. You bring joy to my heart. And yet you guys don't want to trade. They're cautious and they're loyal, the so. To speak well. I wonder if Egypt would be willing to trade with me now. Your embassy is most welcome. Your words are. Trade. Trade is beneath the notice. What does this mean? Uh, I think these guys are about to be wiped out. Since I can't trade with them, defensive. They're at war with almost everybody they know. We don't have any. They were a client stay of somebody or other. So we're trading with some people. So that's good. That's always good. Get some more money. Uh, let's just check to see how much money we're going to get from that. Actually, I should show that in our treasury. Where's our treasury? There's our treasury. I actually didn't ever really look at this. <coughs> Total value, so we're getting 920. What are these? Denari? Or are these? I don't know. Some gold. We're getting 20 something gold, so that's great. We need that. Okay, so what's going to happen here? You guys don't want to join us in our war yet. Yet. You guys asked me to join your war. Now, I don't think these guys will actually do anything or can do anything until my force gets there, so. Oof. I don't think I can't really recruit anything, can I? Thirsty for battle. Death in battle. There is no finer ending. Can't train any more units. It's got three chosen war Let's. Oh yeah, we have our. I live to serve the people of Britain. That's good to know. Oh, we'll go for that. That's the only one you have. We'll go for champion right now. I think that's it. So we will end the turn, see what happens here. Hopefully they don't decide to attack us. I don't know if they can or not. Our agents did something to their general. Oh, okay, so they won't be able to do anything there. Rome's navy is pretty strong right now. Getting quite a bit of trade now. Maybe I can get trade with Egypt. Yeah, you guys don't really hear much about the Iceni trade network, now do you? I'm not sure what those guys are doing. Hopefully you take on some more Roman forces. Okay, so suffering from attrition. Oh, war declared. Oh, our war lord has increased in rank. Our scout died of natural causes. Rome and the Averni are at war now, so yay. That is always great. Okay, so what we can do... What do you want? Okay, this is our war maiden, so we will... 
show force again. My reputation speaks for itself. And it was successful. I am the goddess champion. Unfortunately, our spy that was nearby is the one that died. So we're going to have to actually recruit a new one. Oh, we still need to get a new war maiden. Or druid. We need to get a new druid. Uh, we'll go for us. What's your abilities? I should go for this guy. Now we need a druid. We'll go for this one. This guy. He looks promising. Now, it's time for Bayback. Okay, we're gonna fight this. It says that it's in our favor, but we're gonna we're gonna fight this. We'll get paid back for what they did to us. Okay, so weather conditions: foggy. We'll wait, see what happens. Snow. We'll wait, see. Dry. We'll yeah. We'll start deployment now. Okay. So check this out okay so okay so there's their units there's their ballista their giant ballista we need to get rid of those right away they got some latin slingers levees 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 confident some more slingers we're gonna have to rush them they got some more they, this is a, this is some mercenaries here legays more legays okay that's great because most of their spearmen are well, most of their forces are spearmen, so that's great. They also have a couple units. Uh, oh, they use their Germanic bodyguard. If we have a re mercenary Celtic bodyguard, I should say. Oh, it's actually with mercenary Celtic and Germanic bodyguard. Their Germanic bodyguards are pretty popular amongst the Romans, and I gotta say, I like I like the Germanic bodyguards. That's, this is one of the modded units that's in the game. It's uh, in Sabi's unit overhaul. I think this guy's the general. Remember this guy. This is the last time you see it, you'll see him alive. Okay, so let's get this. Let's get this party started. Let's get this party started. Let's get this started. Ha! Let's get this started. Yeah. Sorry for my horrible singing skills. So move all you guys up front. Group you guys together. Uh, move our general back here. Now these guys are superior to what our units were before. Are superior to our units that we had before. So that should be good. Move. We have two un. We have one, two over here. Oh, we have two units of World Warriors over there. We'll put a couple over here for some flanking action. We'll also move some painted ones over here. Uh, keep this unit of spearmen over back here, just in case they try flanking us. Uh, War Dogs, we'll move over to the side here so we can see if we can get them to sneak around. Okay, let's start the battle. We're going to need to move up everybody fast. Okay, it looks like they're starting to fire us now. We'll keep this. Our general is under attack. By the way, our reinforcements. I I just noticed this, the force with the. Uh... Oh, we got some chariots too, and some move for chariots and war dogs. Cool thing about one of these groups is that they're called the Wood Warriors. I didn't notice this. Here's that other group that was defeated. Farmers, farmers, farm oh sorry that. So we will move everybody here we have. Ooh. 
Oops. We got another group of war dogs. Get them to charge. And get everybody else charged into battle. Well, that was a good hit. That was a good hit. Okay, move our archers back now. So our world warriors have caught up with their mercenary Celtic band, war band, and we're going to clean this unit up with Oh. Okay, the general just charged us, so. to fire at these guys. Let's make sure nobody survives this battle, shall we? Our war dogs are attacking the ballista. They're doing a very good job of it. Okay, so it's become a bit of a massacre now. One of our units has used all its ammunition. Okay, I don't think it was a victory, and with that we won. Now it did say it was on our side, but still a really good one, and we after last battle we needed a victory so yes the yeah, Iceni won their first major victory against the Romans we've won many we've took many settlements from them, but this is actually one of our first victories we've had uh, we will continue the battle and chase down everybody one of our units has used all its ammunition I 
think that's actually almost it. Oh, they look, there's some guys running that way. Get as many of these guys down. Take down as many of these guys as possible. We don't want to see these guys again. So these are what our chariots look like. Ah, this unit's gonna make it. Not sure if that will be a complete one or not, but anyway. Oh well. Our unit of wood warriors are catching up to these guys. And here come our chariots. And I think this is the last main group, actually. Sorry, sorry, sorry. I hope we didn't get any friendly fire from them. Oh. Might need to get some more chariots. Ah! Oh, our dogs chasing these guys. Only two units of this group. Okay, maybe that. And it was a decisive victory one. Uh, it wasn't really a surprise now that I think about it. This is a very interesting image here. I'm just going to take a bit of a picture with Steam. Okay. That was interesting. Now, this is our first major victory against the Romans. We've had many battles with them and we've taken many settlements from them. However, this is our first major victory against them. So, this is pretty cool. Let's see what happens. It's like on the campaign map. And we'll end battle. It was a decisive victory. We pretty much wiped out their entire force. That is really good. We will enslave the captives to get more money from them. And that is it. That one force that Rome had is gone. And we will prove to the... And we will show that we are not... Oh, there's our champion. I don't want to do that one. Unity. So we just destroyed a Roman force. And um, we're going to need uh, to help these guys because the Romans have just taken another force. No, the Romans have taken another spreading fear and doubt. Another settlement from these guys. So we're going to have and our agents been wounded. Our agents wounded, but I think she's still okay. Actually, let's check. Okay, so she will come back to my services. A war maiden over here has ranked up. Willful warfare. Okay, we can't move you guys. We've trained enough of our troops here. Uh, I don't think we s lost any men, actually. We're going to need to wait a few turns and replenish our forces. Uh, can't really do anything there. 
Uh, we'll end the turn now, see what happens. We destroyed a Roman force, so... I wonder if that was angered them or not. We'll end the turn, let's see. Okay, so Rome didn't really do anything. <coughs> We're actually trading with more people, so that's good. That means we'll get some more money. We'll also discover more lands. The Gaelic Confederation. Now, okay, so they were. I wish they joined. Okay, so ready to command our s statesman is ready. Trade gained. Core masters. So we got a couple more bowmen. Ah, a symbol. Battle, victory over Rome. Let's let's keep doing that. We need, however, to keep training more of those units. Those are good units. We need some more chariots. Let's go for a couple of light chariots. They were good for chasing down. They were good for chasing down the uh, stragglers. So we'll move our spy down. I guess we have to. Yeah, it's possible. I could be of I cannot tread this path. Those are details here, so Rome's going down. Germanic's going down. Celtic's going up. Corruption. Not that bad. Slaves. Okay. Soon we'll be able to go on a campaign. Again. Uh oh, they may be able to take this fortress down. Okay, that might be that might be what they're doing. Actually, I'm going to end. The oh, and there you got some forces down here. Oh, and here's another Roman step. That's a Pictonian group. Pictonians are. Uh, well, I think they're a Celtic group, too. Well, male, more like Gaelic. They must have perverted a Roman champion to their side. Because that's a Roman. <laughs> that's a Roman. Okay, let's move our forces down here. I was curious about are the Averni. How are the Averni doing? Let's go ahead and check these guys. Okay, the Averni are building up their forces. So that's interesting. Uh, what can we do here? Is there anything over here that we need to know about? Okay. I think there's not much for this turn, so I think I'm going to end it, this episode, here. We have Victorious Battle. That was pretty cool. The first in our series, without auto-resolving and such. Uh, we got some interesting t situations that might happen. These guys looks like they're going to be going for this settlement. Hopefully Rome doesn't try to uh, stop them or anything. The, the, we may end up having to liberate this place again. That means we're going to have to attack this place. This is a full stack. Uh, we could do it. We'd have to put both our forces together. And maybe do some agent actions. Roman forces are very strong. They're heavily armored. So, And Iceni forces... Well... They aren't as well. So. Well, I think that's going to be it for this episode. I hope you guys enjoyed. Uh, if you haven't seen past episodes, the link to the playlist for the series is in the description below. Uh, if you like, please leave a like down below. Uh, comment. And if you like to see more videos made by me, please subscribe. And I think that's it. So, until next time. Until next time, I hope you guys have a good day.